It's Friday, March 9th, and I'm out at the McDonald's having breakfast. It's a McDonald's in Hyattsville. It's, it's a really nice restaurant. Looking around here, they've got good music going. Um, not a whole lot of people, it's not very crowded. I just ordered something, and um, I'm sitting here enjoying it. I just um, had some sweet tea. There's my other stuff over there. I just had the hash browns. Looks all good. And um, there's a lot going on out there. See, there, there's a lot of traffic. Cars just moving right now. I, I guess everyone's trying to get to work. It's rush hour. It's a good time to be looking at, at what's happening. But you know, the music, the traffic out there reminds me of um, mini buses in Guyana. So I will talk about that for this Flashback Friday. Um, the music especially. <laughs> I know some mini buses, the, the mu you get in there, the music is really loud. We used to say they're jamming music. It's all about the loud music and some customers actually like that. The young girls going to school, they like to go into those buses. They just stand there and wait for those buses to pull up with the loud music and certain music going in there and then they rush in and, and they take off. That's what some buses are known for. Um, <clears throat> the buses to Linden, the 43 buses, um, they're a little different. They play music but not as loud. Um, I remember that trip to Linden very long. You sit in that bus and you, you, you know, it's like over two hours. You just two hours. You have to go east back, then then soon back Linden Highway. It's taking a long time. You just want to get there, but <laughs> there's nothing you can do. The driver's going. You're just sitting back, relaxing, hoping that there there's no accident or, or no trouble or anything like that. Um, those drivers are pretty good, though. They, I, I, I'm pretty sure a lot of them got trained at that trading school in in Linden. They're pretty good. I don't. We we do. I remember there were some serious accidents on that highway, but a lot of the trips they're pretty good. No problems. Um, everyone arrives safe, <clears throat> and um, you know they, they 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 maybe rest or or go back again another trip. It's, 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 it's very interesting. Um, but it has been a while since I've been in a minibus in, in, um, in Guyana. We have the regular big buses here in, in, in the U.S. And I remember that those buses did um, provide service at one point from Linden to Georgetown, but they quickly went out to service because no one wanted to ride them. It took too long. They thought the minibuses were much faster. They liked the service provided by the minibuses. So the, the big buses, you know, they, they all folded. They went out of business, didn't make enough money. I guess the country is a minibus country. I guess people like that. That's interesting. <laughs> but, um, that's all I'm going to say for today, this Flashback Friday. Thank you.